Am I ready? I don't know right now, and that's okay. Hello, beautiful people. My name is Amanda Zitto. If you're new here, I make motorcycle travel vlogs, motorcycle camping, and general encouragement for you to get out and do the thing. There are now seven days left as we're recording this video before I leave for my cross country trip from Sacramento, California to Tampa, Florida. I will be attending the Forgotten Angels trip and then riding back. It's gonna be about 8,000 miles in total on my trusty CB500X. And there's still a lot to do. <laughs> if you have missed earlier episodes in the series or you have questions about the route, please go watch my announcement video before you drop your questions in the comments. I will link that video down in the description and the playlist for all of the uh, prep videos that I've made thus far. With that out of the way, I still have to fix my handlebar screw. I think I have all the pieces for that now. And we're tackling brakes today. SBS was incredibly kind and sent me brand new discs and brake pads for the front and rear of the bike. So I'll start fresh on this trip, but uh, uh, it will require a little bit of um, tinkering. I think once those two things are done, all I have left is to test pack, which is gonna take me a while, probably will not be in this video because it's gonna take me a few days to gather everything together and then put it on the bike. And then I have to do a test run to make sure that all of the farkles on the bike that I've added thus far are gonna work out and that they're working properly. And then all there's left to do is leave. <laughs> But uh, I think today I'm going to start on the handlebar screw because that seems like it should be an easy thing. Every time I say that, it kicks me in the butt, so maybe I won't say that. I'm just going to start with the handlebar screw to work my way up to working on the brakes. Yeah, let's, let's go with that. <laughs> Bar screw fix, which is very exciting. That's been broken for a while, so it feels good for that to be done. No beating around the bush now. Uh, all that's left is to do breaks. Ha ha! <laughs> Front brake disc is on, front brake pads are on, wheel reattached, everything is back together. I have to do the rear brake pads and disc now, um, but it is quite late, so I think I'm gonna break here for dinner and probably for the night, and I'll see you guys in the morning when I tackle the rear one. Cool, 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 cool. Welcome back to the humming garage. Still not apologizing for the hum of the heaters in the background because when I woke up this morning, it was 32 degrees. We have rear brakes to do today. Let's uh, let's let's get a move on. Time time is a ticking.
Okay, rear tire is back on. Rear disc has been replaced. Rear brake pads have been replaced. I can officially mark the new brakes off of the to-do list, which feels amazing because brakes are always a thing that I build up to be more than what it actually is in my head. So it feels wonderful to have it done. It's really not as bad as it seems. Huge shout out to SBS Brakes for sending me the new discs and the brake pads. They did not give me money. They just sent me the new brakes so I would have fresh brakes for the trip, which I'm very excited about. The tire situation is getting taken care of over the next few days. Really, the only things that I have left to do is to test ride the bike, make sure that everything is safe and working the way that it's supposed to, and then pack, and then hit the road. Whoa, am I ready? I don't know right now, and that's okay. For right now though, I think I'm gonna go to bed. I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Make sure that you hit that like and subscribe button if you did. Huge, huge shout out as well to my patrons on Patreon who make these videos possible. I would not be able to do any of this without you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. If you're interested in supporting the channel for as little as $1 a month, you can get early access to these videos over on Patreon. Ad free before the rest of the world. If that's not up your alley, that is totally okay. I also have t-shirt stickers, prints in my Rebelbull and my Etsy shop. My Etsy shop will be closed while I am on the trip. So go on over to Rebelbull. That will be open the whole time because I don't have to ship that stuff out myself. <laughs> Question for my unscreen crew, have you installed brakes yourself before? If you do, do you have a funny story about it? Or do you rely on your trusted mechanic to do that, which is absolutely, totally okay. No shame either way, just interested. And in the meantime, guys, I'll see you later. I do not have my dad's wonderful shop at my disposal where he just like seems to have every little doodad possible. This garage is still in the process of accumulating all of those little doodad things that are helpful when you start a project and forget to actually make a list of all the things that you need to do it.